what's up youtube it's your girl the mac of all trades and i'm back with another savers haul video you guys know that i am working there part-time so therefore i'm going crazy buying shit i have a huge it's basically um it's all clothing items pretty much so um yeah and just like i have told you before my discount is half off so it has its perks of working there. I mean, me and Katie go there enough that it makes sense. But, uh, so let's go ahead and get right into this haul because I have a ton of items to show you. So the first thing I got was this Olathe East because this is where my kids go to school. And this is just a sweatshirt. Carissa likes the ones that don't have hoods or zippers or anything like that. She likes just the plain sweatshirts. So I found this one and it's a size small, but um, it was $4.99, but of course got it half off, you know. Um, then I also got this for Carissa. This is just a cute, look, look how cute this is. She's going to look so freaking cute in this. She likes doing the whole like crop top thing with like the high rise jeans or shorts or whatever and the she likes this style of uh crop tops um like where they have like the stretchy part right there and then she also likes just like the flowers like the actual prints on there she likes the florally ones but this was regular 449 but of course i got it half off and um it's from that uh store garage and she loves that store so i was like hell yeah um but yeah i got her that then um for mr kendall john i got him this nike basketball t-shirt um and this was regular 849 but of course half off and it is a size large and it's in like i it looks like it's like brand new never been worn like that's how good of condition same with that um garage um shirt that i got carissa like it looks like it's brand new um and then I got these for Kendall too. Um, that boy be eating meatball subs every day. He works at a Subway and every single day that's what he has. And he is turning into a meatball from eating meatball subs every day. And so like one of the pairs of khakis that I had bought him when he first started working are now too tight. And he's like, mom, I need bigger pants. I'm like, boy, then quit eating meatball subs every single day. So I got him a pair of bigger khakis. I don't know the brand on this one. Um, let's see, Hagger. Yeah, okay. So then these are a 34, 32 and they were regular 449. Of course they were half off, but uh, then I also got Kendall a pair of jeans cause she, he can wear jeans to work as well, but they can't be like faded or ripped or anything like that. They have to be just regular ass blue jeans. So I found him these, these are old Navy famous jeans. They were regular 699, but of course I got them half off. And here's what they look like. See how they're just like plain blue jeans and that's what he needs for work. But I have a feeling that because of like the wash on here, that these are gonna be the kind that you have to wash with either like towels that you don't care about or other really dark colors. Cause I feel like the coloring would fade onto other clothes. So, um, I got him those anyway. And then I also got Kendall this, um, Pioneer Trail 2019 t-shirt. This is size large. It was regular $3.49. This is, but of course half off, but this is where, um, the Twinkies went to middle school at. So yeah, I had to get him that t-shirt and it has the football right there. And he played football for Pioneer Trail. So just had to get him that, you know what I mean? Um, then I uh, found this for myself and this was $2.49, but I got it half off. And this is the um, Victoria's Secret Pink NFL Collection. And it's a Kansas City Chiefs t-shirt and it just says, Chiefs fans are great kissers. Now I actually have this exact same shirt as a Steelers one. So I'm like, yes, even though I'm primarily Steelers fan, I will root for the Chiefs when they're not playing the Steelers. <laughs> then I also got some, you know how I am about the Victoria's Secret Pink stuff, you know, 
you guys i absolutely love it and i love it when i can find it at the thrift and so i got this cute little like see how it's like kind of holographic -y glitter backpack and look at the straps those are just so freaking cute so i this was 4.99 but of course i got it half off but you guys it is so cute and it's in excellent condition like i almost want to say it's probably never been used because i don't see anything on it that's um showing me that it would have been um and then i got this other little backpack and this one still has the original tags on it and this is also from victoria secret pink so it has that original sorry you guys has that original tag on it and this was 7.99 but of course um i got it half off but it's just cute little black backpack and then it says pink and silver letters right there and then it also has this little like pom-pom little um keychain thing hanging off of here which i thought was really really cute so yeah this is a cute little like on the go kind of backpack and i i love it so i had to get it okay and then you guys um so i did not know i don't know if i've um ranted about this before on my channel I can't remember if I have or not in a different Savers haul. But working there at Savers, I have figured out that um, all these like 16, 17, 18, whatever year old kids are um, coming in there and they think they cute, you know what I mean? And what they're looking for to buy is like Harley Davidson t-shirts and them looking vintage, the shirts looking vintage. So like... Um, you'll see them get like, you know, um, shirts for like when you go on a trip and you buy like a souvenir shirt, like that's what they're looking for. But, um, you guys, they've never been there. They're also looking for the band t-shirts as well. But do they know who those bands are? No, they don't. They'll get like Pink Floyd t-shirts and you ask them, oh, are you a fan of Pink Floyd? And they're like, oh, I just know it's a band. Okay, you've never freaking listened to any Pink Floyd songs and yet you want to wear a t-shirt that has Pink Floyd on it. And then they buy these Harley Davidson t-shirts and they walk around wearing them. And I'm like, you wouldn't be able to tell a Harley Davidson from a Prius. Like, seriously, that's this whole poser. In my opinion, it's a poser society where you're faking it. They're all fake. I don't care if it's a fashion trend or not, but in my opinion, if you don't even know what the fuck is on your shirt, then you probably shouldn't be wearing it. Just saying, and who agrees with me? If you don't know what band is on your shirt other than it's a band and you've never listened to a single song, who is with me that they should not wear that shirt? I want to see it in the comments below. If you're wearing a shirt of a place that you have never been before in your life, you're inviting people to ask you about your vacation there, but yet you never freaking vacationed there. Who is with me? Um, please. I want to see the comments blowing up on that because it it literally drives me insane. Like it it pisses me off. It really pisses me off. But anyway, so I'm on a mission to find all those fucking shirts and buy them so that those kids can't have them. That's how much of a bitch I am. Excuse this video, but there's going to be a lot of cursing, just so you know. And, but I'm also into finding, like, the funny um, t-shirts, too, because I've really been, like, liking wearing them. Um, you know what I mean? With, like, leggings, like the oversized ones. So, I did get this one because I thought it was hilarious. But this one is a men's size large. And it says, cold cock American herbal flavored whiskey and this is actually from a local place here um sp 
Benello's Moonlight Liquors in Gardner, Kansas, which is actually just like 20 minutes away. I've never been to this liquor store, but you know what? I'll go to the liquor store so I can wear this shirt, kid. I will for all those little poser kids that want to watch this. But yeah, I thought that was freaking hilarious. So I got that. Oh, and it was regular $3.49, but I got a half off. Okay, and then I bought Carissa another pair of the ripped up jeans. You know, whenever I see these, I got to get them for her. And these are American Eagle brand. She absolutely loves when they are like that on the end. And these are regular $13.49, but I got them half off. And she is a size zero because she's a little tiny baby. Okay, and then I also picked up this like Sherpa hoodie. This is from the brand Victoria's Secret Pink because you know how I am about that stuff. You know how I am about that, but this was regular $5.99. It's a size medium, and these are so soft. I have one myself, but this one has a KU Jayhawk on there, and I'm actually going to be giving this to my son's girlfriend. Um, I think she. It, this is where she is going to go to college. At, I think her dad and her mom went there, so she's a big KU fan, but like I said, it was regular $5.99, but I got half off, and it is Victoria's Secret Pink, and I just thought this would look so cute on her. Okay, and then um, I got this little hoodie. It's it's hella bright, you know. This is a summer hoodie. When it, if you have a, you know, chilly evening in the summer, it, it's bright AF. Um, but this is a size medium and it's Victoria's Secret Pink. It was regular $5.99, but I got half off. But this is brand new with the tags still attached. Because see here, it has a warning label about um, preventing colors from bleeding onto other surfaces. Wash garment according to care label. But um, I thought this was really cute. And I like how it's, you know, it's definitely going to be like bigger on me. And I like that because then I can throw it on over something, you know what I mean? But, uh. Yeah, super cute. Had to get it. Okay, and then I also got this shirt. Now, you guys, I am not a Minnesota Twins fan, okay? So, don't think that I'm becoming a poser because I'm going to be wearing this shirt. But you'll see why here in a second. Why I'm going to, or you've probably already figured it out by me talking. But this is Victoria's Secret Pink, size large, regular $9.99, but I got half off. But look, it just says Twins. And I have twins, so I have the right to wear this shirt because I actually, you know, have twins. So I had to pick this up. It's gonna be so cute. But what do you guys think? Like, let me know also in the comment. Let me know down in the comments below, do I have the right to wear this shirt? Even though it's Minnesota Twins, I'm not a Minnesota Twins fan. I have been to Minnesota, but I have twins. So I'm, that's the link I'm doing. And I did find a Harley Davidson t-shirt and this is a men's size medium and this is from gail's harley davidson here in kansas city missouri and this is i did find one harley davidson t-shirt um so far in my little endeavors but uh this was regular 5.99 but of course i got it half off it's a men's size medium medium and this is from gail's harley davidson here in kansas city missouri and it just it's kind of you know got that faded look which i like and then it also it's hard to find the ones that have the um store like where it came from whatever store it was bought at on the back like and there's a lot of fakes you guys so um yeah this is local i've been here and you know what my dad uh rode only harleys so yeah i have every right to wear these shirts because i grew up Harley Davidson you know what I mean so I have every right and my dad always like what's funny um is my dad every time like I would go on a vacation or something like that he always was like what I was like what do you want me to get you as a souvenir right and he's always like get me a Harley day go to a Harley store there and get me a Harley Davidson t-shirt but it has to have on the back where it's from because he like that's just his thing so yeah so I got that. It's going to be cute. Um, you guys, this is so freaking cute. This is for Miss Dabbers, but look, it's a little, like, fake Adidas jumpsuit for a little dog. And it says Adidas dog. She's going to look so freaking cute in this. And look how little it is. Can you just picture a little Miss Abby 
like running around in this and this was regular $5.99 but of course um, I believe it was half off I can't exactly remember but I did get that okay and then I got this shirt this is brand new with the tags still attached this was regular $6.99 but of course it was half off it's a men's extra large but this still has the uh, tags attached and this is from Spencer's gift and it was regular $29.99 and this just says drug free um just ran out yesterday so i thought this was freaking hilarious it's gonna look cute when i wear it with like you know my leggings and stuff like that so had to get that then i also picked up this t-shirt this is from old navy it's a men's size medium it was a dollar 99 but of course i got it half off and this is pittsburgh steelers what what so yeah i'm I'm going to see if it will fit Kindle. If it doesn't fit Kindle, then I will wear it. But I'm in love with these, like, men's bigger size tees, like, wearing them. Then, you guys, look at this shit. This is amazing. Okay, so I found this t-shirt. It was regular um, $3.49. It's a men's size medium. And this is actually from the Prince Estate official and approved um, collection. But it's purple rain it has prints on there look i need to watch this movie again i haven't watched this movie in so freaking long but i love prince my favorite song by prince is raspberry beret that is my absolutely favorite song from him and yeah so i had to get this t-shirt it's so it's amazing okay and then you guys I found another band t-shirt. See, I'm coming for you, you little poser kids. And this is from the brand Global. I don't know what, um, where they sell that, but this was only $1.99, but of course it was half off. But this is just a Judas Priest t-shirt. And I really like how it has the kind of like acid wash look to it. You know what I mean? Like this is super freaking cute. But yeah, I had to freaking get it. And it's a size large and men's. But like I said, I uh, like something like this, I would wear and like tuck the front end to some jeans or whatever, and it's going to look freaking cute. I picked up three of these. Now they had some more of them, but you guys, um, do you remember at Christmas time how I did my um, uh, Christmas from heaven lantern or whatever? Well, I got these because... Um, now I can do, I'm going to try to find a way to do an all year lantern, kind of like the Christmas lantern, but I found these little chairs and you're supposed to be able to put a picture in the back of here. Now two of them are missing the backs, but I figured I can make like something out of maybe like cardboard to go in the back there so I can put a picture in there. But yeah, that's what I'm going to use these for. And so I got, let's go ahead and open them. But they were... $2.99 each and of course I got my discount on there but here's what I just have a single one of this but I really like it but I'll probably um it looks like this part probably well I don't know but I'm gonna try to figure out a way to um change the fabric on there or I could also use some of that fabric spray paint stuff like mask off the rest of the chair and use some of that fabric spray paint stuff on there that I got from Dollar Tree but yeah these are super cute and let's go ahead and open the other one as well and I will show you this one too but yeah I'm definitely going to change the fabric that's in the seat but these are it's going to be cute in the lantern but I did pick up three so I can you know craft some more if I ever need to or whatever you know because no one lives forever but yeah I uh thought these were super cute and I had to pick them up they had other ones but uh there but they had like a tiger print I want to say on the seat and I was like no um okay and then the last thing I picked up is for Carissa's room we're doing a whole boho theme when we get to decorating in there and she, I've already picked up two of these little hanging things that are super cute before but I uh, had to pick this one up too because um, of this part and it's just so boho but this was regular $2.99 but of course it was half off 
but uh this is gonna be this is going to be really cute in her room she's doing like a whole gray scale with um mauve in there i think like a pink light pink um that's what her color scheme is going to be and so this will fit in perfectly with that and so yeah so that is going to conclude this um savers haul i got a lot of shit i love getting my savers stuff First of all, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment below and let me know what you think about these poser-ass kids. Because I want to read the comments on that. I need to have validation for what I am thinking and feeling with that. I need your validation, please. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I upload a new video. And with all that being said, thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Me and sweet Betty ain't never seen a bear that can dance before. So it's a one step, two step, three step, four. Follow the go to any dance some more. Dance, dance, to go to dance all around the country store.